Hello and welcome to a video from me, Parer, and today we're going to be looking at the second part of Operation Scar. And if you remember in the last one, I literally just got to this point and I'd seen this terrorist coming through the grass and I decided I was going to wait and pop his fucking head like a melon. Yes, sorry if uh, the swearing offends you, this is not a game for Coddy Kiddies. I expect some flame bait for that, but never mind. So I'm going to be playing this second part of this mission. Absolutely fantastic. I really, really enjoyed this mission. I don't like playing with the AI all the time and having to deal with them. They're just retards. They never do what you want, and it's just faffy. You just want to get in and play. And if you're looking for a mission to do that, that's going to take you 20 minutes to 30 minutes, depending on how stealthy you want to play this, then this is absolutely fantastic. So I'm going to be moving it back to the live commentary that I did while I was recording this. But in the meantime, thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. I'm Holic, and subscribe to my channel for more videos coming soon. I shall see you on the battlefield soon. I've been para. Bye bye. Right, so. Shit, 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 shit. What the fuck is that? You see, that was my fault for getting too complacent. Oh, right in the fucking mouth. That fucker's gonna go. Shit his pants. Oh my god, super uber genius. That's some quality. Putting down is that. Anyway, that's me getting complacent and rushing in now. Right, so my mission here is I've got to eliminate the officer. Now, I'm skylining in myself a little bit here, but I just want to have a little quick look at the building before we get further down. And I know there's that question mark down there. I wonder whether that's going to be the officer's not actually in the building. Let's just have a quick look. Right, let's just see what I can see. I'm going to... I'm wondering if he's going to be dressed differently or how I'm going to tell he's the actual officer. So it's just. Okay, a couple of guys on patrol. Nobody in the windows. One on the balcony. I wonder if it's the one on the balcony. Is there anybody on the roof? Yes, two on the roof. Hmm. If I take him out. Nope. Right, well, it's not him. So. I have to be careful here. Oh shit, he's crouched down. He's alerted. Right, I'm going to have to take these two out. Pop some caps. Yeah, they're down. Right, where's the other one? Right, they're alerted. Mm, he's either going to be in this building, or he's going to be on that one on the right. In fact, there's the third option there. He's going to be on that question mark. Oh my god. Just put him down, Para. Come on. There's another one there. Come on, stick your cabbage up and let me splat it. Right, now what do we do? What do I think? Now, do I go down to that building or do we move this first? Mm, I think I'm, I'll move down, yeah. I'll move down to here because with that question mark, I'm guessing he's going to be in there. So I might go down. I don't know if I've got any flashbangs. I might toss a grenade in and go gung-ho. Have a quick sup of Yorkshire tea. That's what every para needs. Yeah, right. Let's get our ass down to this this building. Just need to keep a watch out for patrols, because you get that that much tunnel vision on the actual objective that you keep forgetting to look around. So let's move on. We just have a look at this building. See if he's not in the window. Nobody patrolling about, is there? Oh, what's that? A flashlight. Where's that coming from? Is that a vehicle? Okay, I can't see anything. Hmm. There's no vehicle up there, is there? No. Right. We'll head down here and probably come across in that defilade or the um, the tree line. And I'm going to come up to the building. I might have a little bit of a listen when we get down there, see if we can hear anybody marching. What can we see? Right, okay. Right. He's looking. I'm going to have to put this dude down. He's down. Get 
Okay, on my way go. It's no time for cheese. Okay, another patrol on the ridge line. Right, we'll take care of him in a minute. Wow, this mission's great. It's just brilliant not having to deal with the bloody winter lickers. Well, I'm just. You see, as you come into the end of the mission now, you start to, you know, sort of run in and be gung ho, and that's when you end up getting killed and uh, with some veteran. So there's no respawns. Right. I might chuck a nade in that door, but if I do, it's going to alert everybody up at that compound if there's anybody left. Let's just see what he's got on him. What's he got? Diddly dee, diddly dum. Hasn't even got any marmite sandwiches. What have we got in here? I might take that. Why? I have no idea. I just fancy a change and we like to go unsilenced. It sounds a lot better when you splat the brains on the grass. Right, let's see if there's anybody around this corner. And then we're gonna. I'm gonna chuck a nade through the window, I think. Brilliant. No, no window on this side. Right. Come on, got a feeling this is where I'm gonna get popped. Right. With the AA sharpshooters. Right. Have some of that. Anybody comes running out? Alright. Whoever's in there is dead, obviously. There's no way they could survive that. If I get killed now, I'm just going in the bin. No, nope. no. Nope. What's this? Somebody playing COD? Destroy it quickly! What's this? In downloading aimbots for COD. Brilliant. Yeah, whatever. Yeah, absolute shabba. Is there anything else I can do in here? Right, I'm not quite sure how that is relevant to anything. It hasn't updated anything. Um, right, okay. Um, I thought that might have given us some sort of, you know, sneaky little, little side objective or something else that we could do. A bit more Yorkshire tea, lads. Hang on. I could do the Jaffa cake right now. Anyway, you're killing the immersion. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. Yeah, we'll soon get this finished. Uh, yeah, yeah, nice one. Just give you position away. We're putting your torch on, knobhead. All right. Move up to this little ridge line, so I've got something to fall back onto. So you never know with the mission maker. You, you, you wonder whether they've made it so. Oh yeah, this is easy. It's nice and relaxed. A bit of tactics, or whether it, if I start popping caps in here now. There's going to be helos and all sorts flying around. Uh, right, I'm going to get up to these rocks. It gives me a bit of cover should I want to start popping some heads. Like melons. Alright. Now why did I swap bloody weapons, one idiot? I'll have to do a bit of a John Rambo. As long as we don't end up doing bow selector, we'll be right. Right, can't see, can't see anybody else down here. Ah, oh, let's have a look, let's have a look, let's have a look. Whoa, there we go, there we go. Right, he's not seeing me. I think I'm going to hide around this corner. Wait till I see his face and absolutely pagger him. Right. Suspenseful, here we go. Now I'll just make sure I don't hit the bloody wall with armor physics. Come on, mate. You're about to die. Gucci goo. Come on. Oh, oh, nice shot. Nice shot. Absolutely terrible. Oh my god. That last shot was in the face, so he ain't getting up for nothing. And we've gone loud, so hopefully, if there's anybody here, they're going to come out. Let's take this carefully. Anybody else around here? No. Right. So he's going to be in this building, isn't it? And is he going to be predictable and be on the top floor, or is the mod maker put him in? Let's get it on full auto because we're fighting in a built-up area. So, right. Let's have a look through these windows and make sure there's nobody in here. No. Okay, we know he can come to the end of this mission. Fantastic. I did. 
wonder if there's any more cool missions, single player missions, so if you can suggest anything you want me to play through and have a look at. I will, I will do, but so far this is brilliant. It's quite atmospheric once you get into it. Oh, bloody armour! Get in! Right, I'm going to go in third person. Right, is he going to surprise me? And he's going to be, I'm going to get annihilated around this corner. Let's have a look, let's have a look, let's have a look. I've got no flashbangs. No. Right. So now it's Operation Hunt the Ragged. Alright. Hunt the Ragged, and I'm all for washing my pots with a tea towel, so let's fucking get a new one. Come on, where are you? It's gonna be in one of these. You in there, you fucker. No. Nope. Well, it's gonna be one of these, isn't it? So here we go. Time to kick some ass. Where is he? Nope. Fucking have it. Nope. Fucking hell. Is he going to be in this one? Let's go pistol. You in here? Yes, you are. And you just stuck. Look at that. Does that, that break every G Geneva Convention oh, possible? Oh, he laid down, surrendered, but we still popped him. And what do we get? Copy, Cobra. Extraction chopper inbound. Move to the LZ northeast of your position. Designated LZ Alpha for extraction. LZ Alpha, right. Vehicle out. Why am I foreign? Right, let's get down here. We'll do this quickly, lads. I know, um, according to anal lictics, whatever it is, a lot of people only watch about five minutes of my videos and then turn off, which is a shame, because uh, I do enjoy doing them. Um, right, how far's the chopper? Let's, let's go in this eh? I'm not gonna run that far. Let's get in. Let's get this to turn the uh, NV off. And really, we should have the lights off. I um, still don't know whether armor has that old, you know, picking up the any enemy uniform. Will the AI actually recognize you as an enemy or not? I, I honestly cannot remember. So, obviously, if I'm in this vehicle wearing the. Um, enemy uh, camo, I should be able to just drive straight past anybody we see, so let's just head down here, get on the helo for extraction. Um, if this is the actual end and I'm not going to get ambushed, then I've, I've actually really enjoyed this. Um, it's not the longest of... <laughs> yep, run them straight over. Um, it's not actually been the longest of missions, but definitely one that uh, you could play and have completely different tactics. Uh, you know, you could be gung-ho, um, be super stealthy and use your pistol. Yeah, great mission. Uh, bigs up to the uh, actual author of this. So let's get in this. Let's get in the bird and see if that's the end of the mission. In the meantime, as I've said before, if there's any missions that you want me to try or play or have a look at or review, leave them in the comments box below and let me know what your favourite single player mission is. That Ones where you don't have to deal with the AI because it's just a pain or where you're uh, actually part of a team and you're on your own still as well. Um, but in the meantime, I've been Para and this has been a review for the Armaholic channel. If my more content on my channel and more videos coming soon from me. In the meantime, I'll say adios and I'll see you on the battlefield soon. Bye bye.